Okay, here's the uh, video on what to do with your domain name after you've purchased it at GoDaddy. Uh, what we need to do is, we're in our GoDaddy account. I have a list of my domains. I found the domain I need. It's 24dayteam.com. I'm going over here and click Launch. The purpose of this is to tell GoDaddy that this domain name is going to be hosted over at Bluehost. So you buy your domain name, which is like having a car, and then you have a hosting service, which is like having a garage. The hosting service I use that I like is Bluehost.com. There's a link on my website. So we go here, 24dayteam.com, and we are looking for name servers. This is the default setup when it's living at GoDaddy. We're going to click Manage. And we're going to edit this. Custom. Custom name servers. It's NS1. Oops. 1.bluehost.com and NS2.bluehost. Dot com. Make sure you don't have any typos. We're going to click Add. It'll take a while for that to um, be active, so we just uh, walk away at this point. I already clicked Save, so that's it. It'll take um, between 20 minutes to a couple hours, and um, the next step is setting up your account at Bluehost, which will be a different video. Thank you.